The Lion Bridge connector for Viva Vault provides users with two ways to select and send content out for translation. Users can send single documents for translation from the library or document view. Users simply select the Send for Translation option from the Tools icon drop-down menu. A translation job form will appear. The user simply gives the job a name. Adding a description and entering a purchase order number or cost code is optional. Then, the user selects a translation workflow and the source and target languages. The user can adjust the requested delivery date for translations to be returned. Once the job information is complete, the user saves the form and the content is sent for translation. To view jobs in progress, simply go to the Translation tab and open the Translation Jobs dashboard. Users can sort by any of the column headings and can edit the dashboard view by using Edit Columns in the Tool Icon drop-down menu. Users can find their job and open it to see the job details. All of the information provided when the job was created is now part of the translation job. Users can view the source document and the target documents for each language. The second way to send content out for translation is in a batch. Users can send multiple documents into one or many languages. From the Translation Jobs dashboard, create a translation job. Users are presented with the same form. Once the job is created, the user must identify and attach the documents for translation. After all documents are attached, the user can select the Send for Translation option from the Tools icon drop-down menu. To view translation jobs in process, return to the Job Status window. The Lifecycle state indicates where the job is in the translation process.